Hi, good morning, my Junior K buddies and families, and happy Wednesday. Today is Wednesday, May 20th, 2020. Don't forget, we have our two scheduled Zoom meetings this morning. One session is at 10 to 10.30, and then the other session is from 10.30 to 11, okay? And then after that, my friends, we have our meet and greet in the St. Clements parking lot from 1 to 2 p.m., all of the St. Clement staff will be there, I will be there, and I hope to see each and every one of you in person. So those are the things that we have going on this morning and this afternoon. We are going to be doing another read aloud on frogs, and then I'm going to go over the work that we have for today. All right, let's get started. Today we're going to read the story titled, Down by the Cool of the Pool. This is a very cool story because you'll notice that the words are kind of different. We'll have to see about that. Down by the Cool of the Cool by Tony Mitten and pictures or illustrations are by Guy Parker Reese. There's so much going on and so many beautiful colors in this story, my friends. Let's read it and find out a little bit more about it. Down by the pool, in the cool of the day, Frog cried, Wee! Can you dance like me? Look at this frog, he looks so happy. And then today, for our Zoom meetings, we are going to be doing a frog directed drawing. So by the end of our Zoom meeting today, you will know how to draw a frog step by step. How fun is that? This frog looks happy. Duck came to see. I can dance too, but not like you. I can flap. <laughs> so Duck went flop. And Frog cried, Wee! Can you dance like me? Down by the cool of the pool. Now, friends, do you see what I mean? Look at the words. Whoa, they're all over the page. That's so interesting, huh? Very cool, there's lots of sound words. Let's see who's next. Pig came to see. I can dance too, but not like you. I can wiggle. Can you wiggle, friends? Woohoo. So pig went, wiggle. Duck went, oh, let's flap, flap. And frog cried, wee. Now your turn. Great. Can you dance like me? Down by the cool of the pool. So, so far we have the frog, and then the duck, and then the pig. I wonder what animal might come next. Hmm. <gasps> Ooh, looks like a sheep. Sheep came to see. I can dance too, but not like you. I can stamp. Can you stamp? Nice. So sheep went, stamp. Pig went, wibble. Duck went, flap. And frog cried, wee. Can you dance like me? Down by the cool of the pool. It's like they're having a party together. A dance party. Then up sprang cat with a sudden bound. And dog came frisking round and round. Goat butted in with a skip and a hop. And frog cried, Wee! That's great! Don't stop! They're all making different movements and different sounds. Then playful pony began to prance. And donkey drummed his hoofbeat dance. But when it came to capering cow, frog cried, wow, all together now. With a stamp and a wiggle and a flap and a wee, the animals danced so joyfully. This is a rhyming book. Till with a bump and a slip and a trip and a crash and a whoops, watch out, 
and a topple and a what might happen, friends? Look at those animals. Oh no. It's like there's too much going on. Splash! Into the pool they flapped and they flopped. But did they stop? What do you think? Do you think the animals stopped dancing? Thumbs up if you think they stopped. Thumbs down if you think they're going to keep dancing. Oh, no, 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 no. For they all cried, oh, and whoop, and wee. Come and see. Oh, ha, 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 he. We're having fun dancing our dance in the cool of the pool. So they were outside the pool now, now they're inside. That's a good way to cool off, especially on a warm day like this, huh? And they splished and they splashed till their dance was done. Then away they drifted and down went the sun. Sounds like they were dancing all day. That would make me tired. As there, by the cool of the ripply pool, with a hop, hop, pop, even Frog was gone. So it's the end of the day now. The frog went back to its home, which is, you know, friends, frogs live in ponds. It even has their two little lily pads into the pond. The end. I hope you enjoyed that story, my Junior K buddies. We're going to go over our work for today, okay? And then I am so excited to see you a little bit later for our Zoom directed drawing. Okay, so what we have for work today is the first thing we have is our frog flip book, which is usually our weekly reader for the week. Okay, so you should have a worksheet that looks like this. All right, make sure we read the directions. So it says frog flip book, color and cut the pictures below. So step one is I want you to color each of these pictures, okay, for the frog. Then step two, take your scissors out and remember our saying, friends, two on the bottom, one on top. Then it's time to go chop, chop, chop. And to make it easier, actually, friends, in the corner, there's a number. Okay, so one, two, three, four, and oh, down here we got five, six, seven, eight. That's the order it needs to be in. So after you're done cutting each of these um, rectangles out, you can lay them out in front of you in order from one to eight, okay? So you know exactly what order to um, staple them in, all right? Put them in order and staple them together to make a flip book. Flip the pages to watch the frog catch its dinner. So... Step one, color. Step two, cut. And then step three, put them in order and have mom or dad staple it together, okay? Here's what it looks like at the end when it's all finished. All right, it's a cute little book. Don't lose it, all right? It might, might get lost easy because it's so little, but it's cool. All right, so you flip through. Miss Cunningham colored it in. Oh, look, he's getting ready to catch the fly for his dinner. Oh, he's almost there. <gasps> yes, he's got him on his tongue. Oh, what a delicious dinner for this frog. Yum, he's saying. Now he's all better and he's ready for another one. So that's what the flip book looks like when you're all done, okay? Then we also have just a blank sheet of white paper. Keep that to the side, okay? Because this is specifically for our directed drawing together, okay? For our frog. All right, my Junior K buddies, I hope you have a fantastic day. Can't wait to see you virtually in a, in a couple minutes and in person at 1 o'clock. Love you guys. Have a great day. Bye.